Mondays. They are concerned tonight. They gather the so Their concern is a new homeless shelter moving into their block. But as Gus Rosendale explains, it's not the shelter itself, but what they fear is a lack of supervision is causing them anxiety. No question, 95th Street and Riverside Drive is a nice part of town. But neighbors are worried about what's happening at number 316 and number 330. Both buildings already contain low-income housing, and now neighbors and some politicians, including the Manhattan Borough President, are criticizing a plan by the Department of Homeless Services that would see hundreds of new people move here. So it just feels like a very sort of unfair thing, and they did it sort of, it feels very purposeful that they did it over the summer when the parents couldn't sort of react. And no one can complain about it, and it, it's, it feels like a real bomb landing on our heads. Quinn Rivers, part of the standing room crowd at this meeting of Community Board 7 tonight. Many here object to the DHS's plan to transfer up to 400 homeless people to housing on 95th Street. They worry these new neighbors won't be supervised and will affect their quality of life. Andrew Rubin lives across the street. There's more drug addicted or substance abuse people that appear to be under the influence on the street, hanging out on the corners, um, bumping into the residents, the, they're leaving trash, urinating. Homeless Services Commissioner Seth Diamond said in a statement, Our agency has a legal mandate to provide temporary emergency shelter to homeless individuals in need and open to shelter on West 95th Street so that our clients can live and be served with dignity and respect. The plan to combine affordable housing with temporary shelter housing also upsets one man we talked to who has worked hard to pay the rent here for 10 years. It's really been traumatic because they're moving and people are not they're insane, you know, they're not, they're not sane, and, and in some cases they're not um, clean, you know, they're not, and they're not screening these people, they're not trying to make the situation better for them, you know, before they move them in. The Department of Homeless Services says it wasn't at tonight's meeting because it wasn't invited, but the department does say it has been trying to work with neighbors to deal with their concerns. On the Upper West Side, I'm Gus Rosendale, News 4 New York.